reporting earnings just moments ago. Joining us for more on the numbers, Till Race CEO Brendan Kennedy. Thank you for joining us, Mr. Kennedy. So, what's your take on the quarter? If you could sum it up for us. We're pleased with uh, our revenue of 51.1 million. It's a 5x growth compared to the same quarter last year. And I think an important part to note in there is that our international revenue grew to 5.7 million. Again, a five-fold increase from uh, the same quarter last year. What, what, what are the projections, uh, Brendan? As you say, some very impressive top-line growth there. What are the projections uh, for when you expect to be profitable on the bottom line? So currently, we're, uh, we're expecting to be EBITDA positive in Q4 of next year. If you think about, if you think about the revenue growth, 500% uh, uh, this quarter compared to the same quarter last year, that's because of investments we made in 2017 and 2018. We have uh, one project left in Portugal that we're wrapping up, and uh, that investment uh, will increase not only our, our revenue going forward, but our profitability uh, throughout 2020 and 2021. How are you actually going to get there to be profitable when you see prices falling and more competitors entering the market? So when we, when we look at our uh, average price per gram, uh, you know, none, of our, none of the pricing on our existing products uh, fell. It was purely product mix uh, based on what uh, the provincial buyers were, were buying last quarter. Um, and it changes from quarter to quarter. Uh, in Q4, we will see uh, new products, new form factors as part of the next phase of legalization, and those products generally have a higher profit margin.